Nayantara teenager Anthony Muchery is thanking Radio King Maynard Kajini for helping him complete his high school studies and being supportive. The Nayantara High School alumnus, who scored a plain B66 points in last year's KCSE exam, told Word his life hasn't been easy, but he thanks Maynard for lifting his soul. Maynard is a fatherly figure, humble and down to earth. He doesn't like publicity and is a kind-hearted man. Many think he's a snob but once you approach him, you'll be surprised by his humbleness," Anthony, 19, said. After scoring 378 in KCPE, Anthony was called to join Mangi High School. He was unable to join the school because his parents could not afford the school fees. I joined Form 1 at Curriculio Boys in 2014 but left the school in third term because I owed the institution a lot of money. In 2015, I moved to a private school and my parents really struggled to pay my school fees," he said. I also depended on bursary funds and would beg politicians to pay my school fees. At the end of Form 2, I left the school. Things became unbearable in 2016, and he was forced to stay at home the whole year. In 2017, a good Samaritan, former Keeper Piri MP Samuel Jikigai, came to his rescue, paying part of his Form 3 school fees at Nyahara High School. The school's principal, Andrew Karami, was lenient and never him sent away for school fees both in Form 3 third term and Form 4 first term. Come second term 2018, I had arrears of SH38K, which I was supposed to pay before sitting the main exam. With no one to help, I had given up and at one point, I told myself that it would be better if I study from home and show up at school just to sit for KCSE, Anthony said. He thought about it for long and decided to travel to Juja, where his aunt stays, to try to reach out to his mentors to help him achieve his dream. I remember it was on a Tuesday morning early May when I left my aunt's house at 3 a.m., just to get to Nairobi in time and meet Maina Kajini before he left the studio," Anthony said. I visited him uninvited and immediately after his show, I followed him downstairs and narrated to him my story. He asked me details about my county government and promised to talk to them so they could help, Anthony said. From there, Maina kept tabs with him and whenever he came back for midterm or after closing, he would meet him and show him his report cards. He was always impressed and encouraged me to work hard, Anthony said. He said he was motivated and Maina is going to pay his college school fees graphic design course before he joins university in September. Anthony, who is now a trained photographer, says the tough challenges he has gone through in the hands of the administration have inspired him to join politics. Come 2022, he will vie for Keeper Piri parliamentary seat in his constituency. I want to represent my people so that no needy student goes through what I went through. I will ensure the government is keen on CDF disbursements and fights poverty through educating my constituents," he said.